Hey, it's me. Just a quick message before the video to say sorry I haven't made any videos for a long time. I've been in Osaka, my new job, and trying to figure out how to live in a big city, and it's um, it's different, different, and has some challenges, but all's good. And I might make more videos this year. Probably not as many as last year, but we'll see. But anyway, on with today's video. Konnichiwa, that's what it is. It's uh, March fifth, two thousand seventeen. Uh, Sunday evening, it's about half past six in the evening on a Sunday. So two days ago on Friday was the day when the Nintendo Switch was released. Woo so today uh, I've had my Nintendo Switch, I hope, delivered. Here is a box. I already bought Zelda Breath of the Wild, um, which came yesterday. So I've got the box and game for that somewhere. Um, I got the collector's edition, so I got like an amiibo. I'm still not quite sure whether Amiibo are worth it or not, um, but there you go, I've got one. I know if you scan it on this game it gives you a saddle for your horse and a sword or whatever, but you know that's in the game already. So, so this is the box that my Breath of the Wild came in, Plex Edition. Um, came with the game itself, Breath of the Wild. This is the plastic box for the game. What's inside? <laughs> Literally just this and it came with this which is a cd breath of the wild sound selection so it's got lots of um uh music from the game hopefully this is the switch that's my zelda game and if all is well i'll be able to play breath of the wild so let's have a look Big old box. Uh, don't know how it's going to open. Here we are. <gasps> it's loads smaller than you'd think, actually. That's funny. It looks so titchy. I've already held a Nintendo Switch, as you may know, because I went to the uh, event in Tokyo. I've already played, I've already played Zelda. I played it for 20 minutes. I was like the second person in the universe. No, I wasn't. Second person from the public, at a public event to play it. So I went with the gray because it was the first one I saw when I was ordering and I didn't really care. I was umming and ahhing about gray or colored. And at first I was like, I definitely want gray. The gray one looks cool, it looks sleek. The colored one looks too garish and bright. Um, but actually, I thought about it, and Nintendo consoles often are quite colourful, like the GameCube was bright purple, and I always liked that. And I always didn't like the PlayStation because it was too boring looking, but here I am with a grey Switch. So this is the Nintendo Switch. It's beautiful. So if you don't know about the Nintendo Switch, it's a home console, more or less, but it's kind of a hybrid home console slash... Um, uh, handheld. In here also in this box is a dock which you can slide it into and it puts the, um, the game onto the TV. So basically this is it. The dock, all the dock does is just, it's got a little connector that this connects to and then it puts the screen up onto the TV. And but the gimmick is with the side controllers, they, I'm trying not to drop it, slide off. So this is the console and actually this has got a little clip at the back. Um, and now you've got the, the controllers here, which you can use just like this in your hand. You can attach it to a controller like frame that puts it into like a handheld controller like you normally have. Or you can play with a friend where you both have like one controller each, so you hold it like this and play with just one little controller. And if you want to play it as a handheld, you just attach those in and then off you go. Play, 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 play. Okay, so here is the frame for the controllers. If you put the two side controllers in here and here, you've got like a handheld controller, just a bit more comfortable to use. Here, I believe, is the dock. Yep. So this is, there's nothing to this, it's just 
I've got some connectors that go through and connect into the, the switch in here. So you can put the console in here, take off the controllers, and now you've got a pretty weird looking, but that's fine by me, handheld controller and docked console. Okay, so, uh, hopefully everything's ready to go. I've plugged in the dock to the TV and the power to the dock. My Switch console itself is sitting here. I've not plugged it in or touched it or anything since I've opened it. The Joy-Cons, as they're called, are sat in the controller there. Um, Zelda's ready to go. Let's see what happens when we turn it on. I'll try and do it on the TV just so that everything's visible to you and Oh, <gasps> change my input. I can see the screen doing something. <gasps> Not quite got the hang of this switching, switching the controllers around. It's a clever choice of name that because everyone's going to keep using that phrase. But you can see the little green light it means it's charging. I'll stay there for a bit. All right. Jump, jump. Here we go. I don't have the volumes on here. Oop, yes, apparently it is. You need the following. Yeah, I've done it. I've done it. I've done it. I'm ready. Alright. <laughs> here we go. Oops. Got the little thing sticking out. That's going to be fun. Press the home button. Boop. To play a game, you can insert the game game card. All right, I'm going to try inserting a game card. This is Legend of Zelda. All right, there seems to be a game card slot on top. And. Well, okay, so yeah, I have played Breath of the Wild for 20 minutes at a demo um, at the Z uh, Tokyo Big Site first public event. Just the same day I left as uh, Gunma, actually, so set seven weeks ago, I guess. I guess it was the beginning of the game. In that demo, I, it, wasn't, it wasn't really a demo so much as it was just a f you had 20 minutes to play the game, I think. So there was no there was no cutscene at the beginning, but then it you woke up in a shriny place. Alright, 